Ivy League. At red light, red light for Tokobaga on cast dry hop with Centennial Hops. It's a little cloudy, that's good, I would expect that. Very little head and close to room temperature. Just what I expect. Doing a quick review here. I didn't even think about it earlier. And I'm not having any more, so. Now's your chance. The aroma is very citrusy, mostly pine, almost like pine sap. Unfortunately, it's not in a tulip or a uh, snifter of any sort. It's in a you know, shaker pint, so you have to really fight. Well, you don't have to fight for the aroma because it's there. There's grapefruit largely out of the citrus family. It's grapefruit. Basically, grapefruit and pine sap, pine trees. It's strong. The hops translate largely. It, the IBUs on this must be well over 100. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Um, it's amazing. And the mouthfeel is above medium. It's definitely a fuller mouthfeel, and it's such a juice. It's not super dry, but it is very balanced. There's a kind of heavy mouthfeel with very juicy taste, and it's like Tokobaga on steroids. The hop aromas transfer very nicely, or translate nicely, into a very orangey, grapefruity taste with almost a pine needle, pine sap taste as well. It's, it's stupendous. I'm going to be very honest here. This is my fourth pint. I can't give it up. It's so good. The cask must be running dry soon. Fabulous experience. This is Fred of our 5ED over and out.